The following contest is a casket match and is for the World Heavyweight Championship. A true blue chip prospect. The son of a WWE legend, and I think he's got a pretty bright future, too. Well, he certainly has all the tools to maybe live up to that legacy. The King of Kings has arrived. A man at the top of this company, at the top of this industry. Heck, there is no mountain Triple H can't climb. One of the best to ever compete. Only three men with double-digit WrestleMania wins, Undertaker, Cena, and this man. Triple H has defeated Booker T, Randy Orton, and Batista at WrestleMania. Yeah, get this, second only to Hulk Hogan in main event show-closing WrestleMania matches. Because on this stage is where Triple H is his most cerebral, his most brutal at the showcase of Immortals. Take no prisoners in the boardroom or in the ring. That's the mantra of Triple H. A man who possesses the singular driving focus to be the absolute best in his career and life. And yeah, knowing that makes him an extremely difficult opponent to prepare for. The game is about to begin. Introducing the challenger from St. Louis, Missouri, weighing in at 255 pounds, Randy Orton. And his opponent from British Connecticut, weighing in at 255 pounds, the world heavyweight champion, A highly contested World Heavyweight Championship handed to our official. Each superstar getting a glance of what's at stake. There are no pinfalls, submissions, disqualifications, or countouts. The only way to win is for a superstar to force their opponent inside of the casket. After closing the casket lid shut, the remaining superstar will be declared the winner. Now, let the match be. We know the 
the stakes. World Heavyweight Championship will go around the waist of tonight's winner. The energy in the arena is palpable. Goosebumps are tingling throughout my body, Michael. We know our combatants must have butterflies in their stomachs. The nerves need to steady, as these competitors need to bring their A game if they hope to leave with the World Heavyweight title. The energy in this building is palpable. He turns it around. Oh my goodness, dribbling the opponent's head like a basketball. What are they going to do here? All oh, going to power, power them up. Bang! Just like that. Uh-oh, he's searching for something. Oh, he knew exactly what he was looking for when he started digging under the apron. No one just finds a sledgehammer. on top of the casket. Dangerous situation for both competitors. And a thunderous body slam on top of the casket lid. inside of you, the place where all remorse is absent. Launched through the ropes on top of the casket. Dangerous situation for both competitors. And a thunderous body slam on top of the casket lid. Tough position to be caught in here. Plummeting face first on top of the casket. And Triple H's opposition showing some answers to the test the game presents. Yeah, and that was that inherent instinct of Randy giving him a leg up. He is delivering elbow after elbow. Of attack from Randy Orton. The young man forging his own path in this match. And he goes into the ring, fishing for something beneath the ring. Bringing out that kendo stick means he is truly willing to go to the extreme. Uh-oh, captured. Ooh, face buster by the game. I see how it is, going to take any shortcut to bypass a clean competition. Hey, there's nothing wrong with a shortcut, Saxton. Tossed into the casket! It's about to get very dark in there. <laughs> Trying to... Not ready to put the lid on this one yet. Apparently closing that casket is easier said than done. Triple H balanced himself up top. Orton never saw that coming. What you're watching now, ladies and gentlemen, is legendary. Triple H on the comeback trail. Look out, face booster. The challenger not looking good right now. Triple H isn't messing around. The King of Kings is out to do damage. Uh, caught him. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. No way. No way. Three. The end could be near. Stay focused and make your way to the casket. Oh, into the casket they go! Oh, no. Rest in pieces. 
Rose. Can they close the casket? But the, the opponent is trying to fight back. It's about... And they're able to fight their way out of the casket. They can't be human. That's ridiculous. Into the ring now. Ooh, got clipped by the thrown kendo stick. Can Orton withstand this attack? Looks like Orton's struggling here. Well-placed elbow to break up the maneuver. to find down there. He's grabbed a shovel and this match just took a sadistic turn. Able to interrupt the attack. Oh man, caught with that shovel. Plenty of ways to get creative up on the entrance area. Also plenty of ways to get yourself seriously hurt. And no one could have predicted the lengths these superstars would go to to steal the show tonight. troubles. Toss back into the ring. Ooh, stiff punch. Randy with a counter. Reversal on top of reversal. Triple H plants him with a spine buster. That right there was that craftiness of Triple H. Executed to perfection. Now that was the advanced stage of Triple H's master class in effect. That is how you operate. Just take a look at the... Both arms hooked. Trying to put them away. Able to counter it. And a close line counter. Randy looking to get back in this. The Viper got tired of being pushed around and is set to start striking back. Big back. And this one might be headed ringside. Oh, we've got a strong... Close call for that superstar. How the hell did they survive? He climbs into the ring. Randy Orton calls this... The Ozone! The title's in jeopardy here! Shifted. Oh, a nasty stop to finish it off. Bang! Oh. And he's taking this to the outside now. Oh, man, take me out to the ball. out here no safe confines to speak of it's been a hardship for these superstars to get to this point i think these fans are driving them to claw that extra inch you can sense the ride these fans have been on it and i'm like 
Randy Orton calls this the O-Zone. This is the time to get them in the casket and try to win this thing. Oh, my gosh. And he tosses it back in now. Back on Orton. Big time clothesline. Good grief. This place is going insane. The ground beneath my feet is shaking. Answering back. Sends their opponent into the casket. Now this one may be over. He leaves the ring, and there's no countouts in this one. Trying to close the lane. Try This is going to be tough. It's not over yet. sigh of relief and he'll leave the ring for this next stretch DDT Randy Orton calls this the Ozone no time to waste now he's got to get him inside that casket as soon as possible And this match will head back to the ring. Triple H looking to end this match. Pedigree. I think the champ's got it. Taking this to the floor. The game is one step ahead. And back in the ring we go. Ooh, didn't see that one coming. attacks are disorienting him. Sustained attacks up in that area could cause impaired vision. Into the casket! If they close the top, this one's over! He'll head to the ring. Triple H has him so hoisted up, double underhook. Weaves out, countered with a vicious clothesline. Second row. Oh, he went to the back. Counter from Morton. Caught the leg. Oh, uh, here he goes. Count three. Now is as good a time as any to capitalize and get them into the casket. Yeah, but it 
it's not going to be easy. They are completely out right now. Held in a perilous position. An extremely perilous position in which to find yourself. Oh my God, even worse. All that happens now is the casket is closed. Desperately trying to force the casket. And finally, it's over. Fade to black. A successful title defense for him tonight. He's definitely fought to keep his championship, and that's something he should be really proud of.